Dan, tell me about today's event. Today's event's about making some money for some kids to have a chance to go out and play some team sports, do some mixed martial arts. Today's event is about Travis, my brother, who's passed away. He was hit by a drunk driver, and we're here today to come together as a community, uh, not just Travis' local community growing up, but also the community he's expanded out to in Toronto and the York Regional. Everybody's coming together, and we want to have some fun, remember Travis, and we want to raise some money for some kids because that was important to Travis. This arena meant a lot to Travis. This is where we grew up playing hockey. We, all, we played hockey on the pond behind my parents' house growing up as kids, but we also grew up playing hockey here with actual referees, not just pond hockey. And this is where we made a lot of memories. We, we learned our building bridges skills for life, um, just being part of a team, what that means. As you might know, Travis was going through the emergency response unit. That's probably one of the strongest teams here in Ontario. What, uh, what do you think about the response today? To, it's a pain I wish to stop now. What do you think of the response? It's uh, the parking lot's full beyond full. I, I think we're going to hit the peak in the next hour here with people and hopefully they stick around to the 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock final games and hopefully our, our team, the Shiloh Sheepdogs, are in those finals. What would Travis think of this? Travis is smiling down on all of us right now. Dan, tell me about what it's like to hit the ice now. Uh, a, little, uh, a little exciting on the nerves just because we're all out here and we're having fun, but it's starting to get competitive. Um, when you take that first good. face off, it, uh, does it hit home what it's all about? Feels good to be out here. It's going to be a good day.
they end up playing here. You have to get more jerseys somewhere. Event <laughs> oil games. Yeah. I don't know where they're from. And Shiloh. Oh, so Tell me, uh, tell me what this day means to you and your team. Well, Travis Gillespie was a uh, was a hometown boy at Workworth, known within Workworth and uh, the Brighton area. A friend of mine and uh, part of our local family, and uh, him, him, uh, unfortunately, and and uh, what happened on back in September of last year was was something that sits very very poorly with us all. And uh, this is just a testament to his, his personality and his legacy. Hardworking guy, great community person, and very loving person. This tournament's put on by his friends and family just to recognize who he is and what he's about. And uh, all the people that are playing here, friends of his, relatives of his, co-workers of his, and uh, everybody wanted to get together to, to celebrate him. It's a perfect spot to have it in, is what people are saying, because he grew up in this arena. That, that's true, he's a, he's a work with a minor hockey boy, and um, the, uh, the Shiloh Sheepdogs are probably one of the teams in this tournament that best represents uh, Travis and what he's about. And um, yeah, a great place to have it, great community event. What would he think of this? He would love it. I was just talking to his, his fiance upstairs before our game, and she, that's exactly what she said. She said he would love this. He's smiling. Yeah, he's smiling right now. He'd love the music, he'd love the competitive, competitiveness, and he'd love all the people being here.